Hey, good morning. So I just finished the workout first uh, week back at working out doing my nine round kickboxing, which I love, 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 love. But I wanted to jump really quick and give you a quick voice note, vocal athletes. So I've been asked, uh, one of the questions that comes up during my webinar is how can I build stamina when I'm singing? And you can build stamina for singing by doing cardiovascular exercises. There have been several times when uh, someone would submit to me a video for vocal assessment and I noticed they are breathing and so heavy and are really struggling to maintain um, their their breath, their their breathing and, and maintain their ability to to sing effectively and efficiently. And so one way to build your stamina so that you can carry the weight of the assignment, hello, is by practicing cardiovascular exercises. So the benefit of cardiovascular as a vocal athlete is that you can increase your lung capacity. You can also train and develop and work on your breathing mechanism, which encompasses the muscles surrounding your visceral area or your gut area, your diaphragm and your lungs. All of that is a part of your breathing mechanism. And so when you do cardiovascular exercises, whether it's just going for a walk or running or swimming or something that's gonna get your heart rate up, you're gonna be able to increase your stamina. So uh, check Check these two videos out from uh, two days of my <laughs> my workout. Think about when we're working core work is your breath work. One thing Kate Ken's doing a really good job right here. She's breathing out when she does her knee drive. Breathe out and then she breathes in as she comes back to the ready position. Breathe out, comes back. So when she's trying to work her core, she breathes out. Boom. How about that? <laughs> so if you want to know more about breathing and building your stamina and just overall vocal health, DM me the words vocal athlete so you can join the next webinar. It's coming up soon. I'm doing them every two weeks. I don't want you to miss them. You can gain more information, more insight and become a better singer and become the vocal athlete that I know that you already are. But I'll see you at the next Becoming a Vocal Athlete webinar. See you soon.